I want to welcome you guys to the iMac Regeneration Center. Uh, this is the original location in Paducah, Kentucky. We actually opened this in 2015. And so behind me you're going to see some green. So all of our clinics in the five states have the same floors, the same colors, but we all have different accents. So Paducah's green. You're going to see a lot of green in this, in this facility. Um, this is our waiting room. Now you're not going to see a lot of chairs because we're just coming out of the COVID. 19 problem so you're going to see less furniture you're going to not even see signage up right now because we just had some stuff repainted so uh, hopefully you'll learn something today and if it can help anyone then that would be a blessing so again we're in five states we have 15 different clinics uh, we went public last year trading on nasdaq so a lot of growth in the last four years and i have a lot on the horizon too and we'll talk about that a bit on our tour today so if we go through the office, this is going to be our medical wing. So in our offices, in all of them, we offer medical services. We offer a uh, chiropractic and we offer uh, some re physical therapy and some other things as well. But you'll see them on the tour. So first is, uh, we'll go here first. This is the boardroom. So a lot of our, this is under a bit of painting as well. So we're going to have the NASDAQ wall here where we're, some pictures of where we went public. but. A lot of people come in and we train them in this room. We have a lot of athletes that come in, uh, some of our endorsing folks and just business people will come in and just kind of spend the day here. This is, this is more of a transition room. And as you can see, we're coming out of COVID. There's chairs everywhere. But this, this side was actually built out for some of our newer services that we haven't even offered yet. Uh, so we built this wing and just after we got it built, our, our business kind of took off and we needed more space for our billing department. So this entire, entire hallway is our treatment rooms, but they're filled with business people where we do our billing for all of our uh, 15 locations. So we'll travel back through here. Again, you'll, these are, when, you, when patients first come to our office, these are our first treatment rooms. So you can, you can see patients in here. Again, we have the green accent for the Paducah offices. So our new patients hang out in those rooms. This is a blood draw station. So a lot of our treatments involve uh, dealing with connective tissue problems, meniscus, rotator cuff, disc, problems that where joints are not, are not stable any longer. So this is a draw station where they draw blood and we spin the blood down and get the cells out. And come on back here, this is our lab. This is one of our two labs in the office. So once uh, patients come in, if we harvest cells like platelets or stem cells from the patient, they process the cells in these centrifuges and under the hood. And so um, we have another one on the other side. This is um, x-ray. So a lot of our cases that we see, we have a full-time x-ray uh, people on staff. So this is digital x-ray. And then we kind of start the fun part of the office. These are treatment rooms. This is the St. Louis room. So. Because IMAX started in Paducah, we wanted to highlight all the other offices in our clinic because the other offices have an athlete. So for instance, this is the St. Louis room for the St. Louis Cardinals. Ozzie Smith was one of our first athletes that came to see us and he had a great outcome and he said, you know, Matt, you need to have one of these in St. Louis. So funny part of our story, I said to Ozzie, well, why don't you let me use your name? And he said, I'd love to. So that's how the, the, the second IMAC Center got started in St. Louis. It was, it's called the Ozzie Smith IMAC Regeneration Center. Now we have two of them in St. Louis. So this highlights him. We're not finished. We'll eventually we'll have the signage up here that says the Ozzie Smith IMAC Center. We'll have kind of the St. Louis uh, city here. So again, just a fun thing for a patient since they're coming for treatment. We want them to have fun and, and experience. This is the Paducah room. This is where we do our bigger procedures. So we have a full a C arm here, so a lot of our spinal cases, if you're dealing with a disc or a facet or some kind of real bad spine problem, we have patients come in from all over the country. Matter of fact, there's some patients here right now from Texas that have moved up here. We have patients come from other countries, had one from Romania a few weeks ago. Uh, so we do some really cool stuff with the spine in this room. So this eventually will, will be the Paducah Original IMAC Center highlighting the green. Down the hallway, you'll see some Paducah pictures. So we're real proud that IMAX started in Paducah. Uh, as you can see, um, 
this is a, this is an athlete that, that came out of California. He's a power lifter, so we have some of the stuff around the office. This is the Chicago room. So one of our clinics now is in, or we have three clinics in Chicago, uh, and they're called the Mike Ditka IMAX Center. So Mike was a coach, as you know, Hall of Fame guy. So we have the Chicago Bears. Eventually the city of Chicago will be here, and all of Mike Ditka's jerseys and things will be here. So he's been a great endorser of IMAX. And then we'll go into the Lexington room. So we have one clinic in Lexington, Kentucky, and um, it's fully integrated as well, and it's the Tony Delk IMAC Regeneration Center. So eventually we'll have the Tony Delk, we'll have the city of Lexington and some of his jerseys in this room. So it's just a fun thing for our patients. When they go to the doctor, again, we want them to have a good time and, and not feel you know distracted by some of the pain that they're in. As we proceed, we'll go into the, this is our main, main waiting area so as you can tell there's hardly any furniture here because we're still in the COVID problem and on this wall we highlight some of our original athletes that ever came here now we've seen hundreds of athletes but these are some of our first ones and you see Wheeler Harrell was a safety for the St. Louis Cardinals when they used to be the, one of the original NFL teams Jonathan Bender was the first pick in the draft played for the Pacers uh, busted his knee and kind of ruined his career Mike Jones for the Titans. There's Ozzy's jersey. Even one of our local celebrities, Menendez, we've treated. And you have uh, some of the, some, uh, some weight power lifters. They come out of California. We treat a lot of guys that come from that area in California. We've got Maurice Evans, the Lakers. And so these are some of our originals, but we've treated, you know, the Iceman from San Antonio uh, so we don't have his jersey. There's a whole lot of cool people. We, some of the Celtics have been here. So there's been a lot of people that have come to Paducah through our little airport just to come here for treatment. That's pretty, that's a fun thing. This is another cool thing that we have in all of our IMAX centers. We have the Wall of Canes. So we own wallofcanes.com. And so it's important to us that not only our patients feel better, but we give them a goal. And some of our patients have reached that and they have their canes on the wall. So. That's just a fun thing you'll see in all of our offices. Jerseys, you'll see the wall of canes. And we'll continue on through the integration process. You can see it's all kind of looped together. Uh, this is our physical therapy area. And you can see that we do a tremendous amount of spinal uh, treatments in this particular area. Uh, we're kind of closed up for, for the lunchtime area right now, but you can see that this is real similar to all of our IMAX, have a, have a very similar look to them. They have high ceilings, uh, more of a warehouse look. So uh, we're kind of, think of our business model kind of like a Chick-fil-A. We want the color scheme, uh, the carpets you can see, they all have squares. In St. Louis, you'd see a red one where you see a green one here. You, in Kentucky, in Lexington, you see a blue one. So they're all pretty much decked out the same way. So that's a... Uh, pretty much a, a tour. We have the chiropractic area over here. You see some patients in here now, but we have, actually, you know what, let's go down this way. I think there's no patients. Let's see, again, COVID's up, so we've got some partitions up here now, but this is our chiropractic area that patients come in. And, a lot of patients come here for treatment, and when they're finished, they like to stay with us for, you know, years to come. So that's our chiropractic area. Um, these are some. This is an interesting area. Here we have we call doctor report rooms. So our patients, when they come in, they want to learn, you know, what's what's wrong with me. I think one of the things I think we do a really good job is that. Patients that come into our office have been dealing with a condition sometimes for years and years, going to all kinds of doctors and treatments. So for us at IMAC, like part of our philosophy is you, you gotta learn what's wrong with you. So we spend a tremendous amount of time with a new patient, teaching them organically, like what's really wrong with their spine or what's what's actually wrong with their knee so they can they can see the MRIs. We have models here to show them. And you know, people learn different ways, but the majority of people learn by, by watching and looking. So we spend a tremendous amount of time before we start a relationship with the patient and sitting in here with their spouse, just trying to help them to understand what's going on. So that pretty much wraps up our tour of, of, 
of our offices. I hope that you learned something and we can talk more about this uh, on our, uh, our journey on Thursday.